Whenever I'm having a bad day, I like to remind myself that I have ginormous knockers and I immediately feel better. Yes, I get the same feeling when I look at my bank account or when I drink the blood of virgins. But I must say, you Western women take pride in the most insignificant of things. Ginormous door knockers. Such a strange flex. Public service announcement. I have a good job. Sincerely, we don't care. I pay for this place by myself. We still don't care. I can make myself awesome. Sweetie, any human can self-service. It's actually easier for women because you don't need opposable thumbs. I warm enough at night by myself in my own bed. And you can stay that way for all I care. Be yourself by yourself. Stay away from me. I feed myself. I can fix my own Wi-Fi. Every day, more lies. I love my own company. I'm cool. That's, um... Debatable. I mean, you're making this video in a messy bathroom while holding a box of cookies. Your standards for cool are very low. So if I choose to have you in my life, it's because I want you. I don't need you. And if I'm speaking to you or talking to you, you're the only person I'm talking to. Because like everything else in my life, if I deem you valuable enough to put time into, I'm going to give that 100%. That way, if it doesn't work out, that's on you. I left everything I had on the court. Cool. What? Sorry, I dozed off, but uh, sincerely, we don't care. Just because you haven't caught him yet doesn't mean he's not cheating. And don't y'all dare comment, not my man, y'all stay safe though, baby. He's cheating, and if he's not cheating, he's thinking about other women, I promise you. I promise you he's thinking about other women or looking at other women this isn't me trying to make y'all scared or trying to make y'all throw up because i know i know that feeling i've been through it i'm just trying to say open your eyes you know what let's say you're right about men what are you gonna do about it you'll do nothing you'll do fucking nothing that's what i thought have a nice life if you are getting married and you think that your relationship is solid go to a prenup meeting Go, to, just go, just go. I think everyone should get, you know, a prenup and a postnup. I really do believe in it. Every day, more lies. But just go to the meeting and see how strong your relationship is afterwards. Sweetie, a prenup is 90% about finance and 10% about child custody. The only reason a relationship would suffer because of a prenup meeting is if the woman only wants the man for his money. If she was actually a strong independent woman who made her own money, she wouldn't care about getting cash and prizes in divorce court. So, if a prenup meeting makes you feel uncomfortable, there's only one thing you should do. Make. More. Money. And that's the bottom line. Cause don't go censor. <laughs>